Hello? Have you ever wanted a feature phone that can do the capabilities of a smartphone? The Nokia 8110 4G is here to save the day. Sleek looks, brand new OS, and nostalgic design. Is the new Nokia 8110 4G gonna be your next feature phone companion? Let's find out! Staying true to the original, the Nokia 8110 4G looks the same with the first one from 1996, but now more slimmer and sexier. The curved protective cover for the keypad is still there, but still functions as a mechanism for answering calls. I suggest you to get the yellow color if you buy one, because it really stands out from the crowd. The phone comes with a 2 megapixel camera, and actually produces decent shots with the right lighting. Video recording can record up to 480p resolution, and is also good in outdoors or wild conditions. You will experience frame drops in low light conditions though. The 8110's unique feature is a keypad slider, which you can slide open to unlock the phone, and also used to answer phone calls. Unlike last year's 3310, the 8110 comes with Wi-Fi and 4G connectivity, and luckily, you can also share your mobile data as a Wi-Fi hotspot. The sound quality of the Nokia 8110 4G sounds great. It's loud and clear, and surprisingly, it's louder than my Nokia 6. Here's a video comparing the two. The 8110 runs KaiOS, which Nokia calls Smart Feature OS. KaiOS is still in its early stages, with some little lags and crashing here and there. The OS works well at some times, but there are times that you'll experience crashing even in the most basic apps like for example, the Contacts app. I really hope KaiOS will push more software updates for the OS and fix things, and learn things from Nokia Series 40 OS. To be honest, KaiOS got a long way to go and I'm actually happy that the team behind KaiOS are working very hard to fully develop the OS. Just last week, a firmware update was pushed to the device, bumping the phone's firmware from version 10 to version 12. The call quality is great, it's clear, and the signal reception is okay. I never experienced drop calls while using this device as my daily driver. Battery life is one thing that I like about the Nokia 8110 4G. In heavy usage, it will last for a day, but for moderate usage, it will last up to two days in just a single charge. And for light usage just for calls and texts only, it will last up to a week. The only downside I see is it charges slowly when using the charger that came bundled with, to the point I have to use my Nokia 6 charger just for it to charge faster. Overall, the Nokia 8110 4G serves well your most basic needs, like texting, calling, and a little browsing. Social media, not so, as some social media apps are still not available in KaiOS. If you're not bothered in trying a phone with an OS in its early stages, then go for it. Things like 4G connectivity and Wi-Fi hotspot works great in this phone too. If you're planning to buy the Nokia 8110 4G, make sure to check for software updates. The newest update brings Google Apps and stability improvements to the phone. The Nokia 8110 4G is now available to Nokia stores near you.